Hey everybody, it's Amy here, and uh, thank you for joining me for another fun art project. Today we're going to make an abstract face, a large abstract face. And what is abstract? Abstract is art that uses colors and lines and shapes to express how you feel. It doesn't necessarily have to look realistic or like a real face. Obviously, you wouldn't see these on pe people's real faces. So. Um, and all the fun colors and uh, design that I use, that's why it's called the abstract. So let's get started. First of all, you're gonna need a large piece of paper. If you do not have a large piece of paper, I'm gonna show you what you can do to create a large piece of paper. You also need some crayons, markers, um, a black marker, I use a Sharpie, uh, a pencil if you'd like, um, I'm going to draw mine with a Sharpie, but if you want to draw with a pencil first, then you'll need to trace it with a Sharpie. Um, you can use um, paint if you have paint and you want to paint it, that's fine. Uh, anything chalk, whatever you'd like to color it in with, that would be awesome. So let's get started and make our paper. Um, if you have some smaller paper, we're going to tape these together to create our large piece of paper. There, I have my large piece of paper ready to go. So first of all, you wanna take, uh, if you have a piece of paper uh, like this one that you didn't have to tape together, um, you need to draw with a pencil a really, really light line down the center. First of all, we want to start with our nose. So you're gonna take your finger and right where the papers cross or your pencil lines cross, you're gonna put your finger and trace the length of your finger. My nose is gonna be a little bigger than your nose because my finger is probably longer than yours. And this time you wanna push down hard and actually I'm gonna draw with a Sharpie so that you can see it better. There's my straight line. Okay, that's the bottom of our nose. Now we're gonna do two lines at an angle pointing towards the middle of the paper. And we're gonna stop. Now we're gonna take a straight line all the way to the top of the paper. Go all the way to the top, right off the edge of the paper. Okay, that's our nose. Now we're gonna draw the mouth. So what, I'm, what I usually do is I measure my finger under the nose and that and make just a little mark that's where the top of my mouth is going to go so it's kind of like a flattened uh, rainbow shape half of a circle so i'm going to just make that shape right here that's the top part of my mouth now if you want to get fancy and add a lip shape you can do that i'm just going to keep it simple now the bottom part of my lip will be the the same shape but the opposite direction, kind of like a little smile. And then I'm gonna draw a line straight across to divide the lips. There's my mouth. So then I wanna draw um, my chin and the bottom part of my face. So I'm just gonna take my finger, I'm just gonna make a little dot there. Now that's where my line is uh, going to go, but I'm gonna start over here on the side, right at the side of my paper. And I'm gonna make a big smile, right? Crossing over that little dot I made, right up to the other side. That's gonna be my chin, the bottom of my face. Now we're going to make our eyes. So we wanna come up here about uh, maybe a finger's length or two from, depending on how long your fingers are from the top, make a little dot. I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. That's just gonna show me where my line's gonna go. It's gonna be kind of like the mouth. We're gonna draw a, kind of a flattened, flattened, oops, didn't quite meet the dot there. Oh well, that's okay. Flattened a uh, rainbow there. And then the bottom half of my eye. And make sure to go all the way over to the touch the nose. You wanna make sure all your lines close. Ah, there we go, I hit the dot on that side. And the bottom. 
So there's my uh, outside of my eyes. It's okay if they're off just a little bit. Remember, this is abstract art. So now I'm gonna do the, my iris of my eye by making a curved line. Make sure to touch from the top all the way to the bottom and from the top all the way to the bottom on this side. Then we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Now you can draw with a pencil so that if you mess up, you can erase your mistake or redo it. And then I'm gonna draw my iris of my eye. Okay, and now we need our little neck down here. So I'm just gonna do a straight line down here like this and a straight line down here like this, all the way to the edge of my paper. So that face that you just draw, uh, drew should fill up your whole paper. Now this is the fun part, what you get to do. Um, I usually take a draw line from the middle of the nose. I follow my pencil line, stop at the top of the lip, and then start at the bottom of the lip. Because you might want to do a different design on this side of the face than on this side of the face. So this is the part where you get to create your face. You can use any shape any design that you want to draw on your face. Um, so let's just do a little fun thing here. Uh, I think for this face, I'm gonna make these curvy. Now the fun part is where we're gonna color this in. So as I said before, you can use paint, you can use markers, you can use colored pencils, you can use crayons, you can use a combination. You could use crayons and markers or colored pencils and paint. Or if you have some oil pastels, use oil pastels, they work awesome too. So I'm gonna use a little bit of both. I think I'm gonna use a little bit of marker and a little bit of crayon for this one. So those are the supplies that I have available right here. Um, so we're just going to start with the eyes. Here we go, it's finished. My abstract face. So see, take your faces and have a fun time. I'd love to see how creative you can be and the different colors and designs you can make with your face. Make sure to let us see them. Thank you for joining me today, bye-bye.